Yo, yeah, right, guys, it's Game Boy Luke, and welcome back to some more Fire Red Omega Nuzlocke. Did you see that little, little, little clip I just showed at the start where it said, after deep thought, Luke put Squirtle in the dead box? <laughs> How bad does that sound? Okay, so, in the previous episode, ignore Syndical, he's just a HM slave. If you missed the last episode, you should go back and check that out before watching this video. But yeah, we did get Echo level 29. We uh, got our Blood level 29. We have our Ludicolo, who evolved from our Lombre. We found a Waterstone that I blatantly missed in the, uh, the the episode before last, so we picked that up and evolved uh, Ludicolo. We also have our level 28 Primate right here, and we also have Pidgeotto. So, um, right here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to not open my Pokemon menu. I'm going to go to my TM case, because we have a TM Dig here, and I think that would be useful when battling uh, Lieutenant Surge, and luckily, Primate, you mad bro, can learn this, so... Uh, Karate Chop does 50, Low Kick does the damage depending on... Um, depending on uh, their weight, I think, uh, does they have your foes. And I don't think we really need to Seismic Toss because it only does damage matching the level. And I don't really feel that that's useful for a Pokemon that can do more damage than that. So it's good if you had it on Chansey or something like that. But for a Primate, Seismic Toss isn't really a good move. So here we go. All right, so let's do this. Let's just take down the trainers in here first because this puzzle is really annoying. So let's just uh, talk to this guy. He has a Pichu. It's just gonna dig, dig, dig a dig, dig a dig. Eat your face. Um, we're gonna freaking so many paralyzed. We should probably buy paralyzed hills. Actually, saying that, we'll do that when we get out. Uh, I just used low kick, which probably wasn't the smartest move. Um, he's gonna keep Sonic booming us. Sonic boom, Sonic. Oh well, confused. Cat. <gasps> Switch out. I just switched out to the wrong Pokemon, fake out, oh uh, shit, bullet seed. Wow, we hit five times, the one time we hit five times. Wow, we hit four times, go fucking go on Macarena. Alright, we need to leave, right now. No, nope, don't want to walk in this house. What did I say I was going to do? Buy Paralyzed Hills, that's what I said I was going to do. I, I'm so forgetful, like seriously. That's so bad. Um, Okay, let's head to the, uh, the Pokemon Mart. I'm going to say Pokemon Center. I'm going to head over here by the Paralyzed Hills because if I get static on anything, I'm just going to go mad. Uh, we actually have loads already. I don't know why I'm buying more. We do need Super Potions, however. We did use all those up, so let's buy 20 of those because you can't go wrong with a bit of Super Potions. All right. I make sure to get out before battling a gym leader. Um, don't want to forget to do that, otherwise you're going to lose team members, and that's not fun. Thank you, Cyndaquil, and there's one more trainer to beat, we'll beat him, and then we'll then we'll uh, figure out this puzzle. Um, I remember having this strategy guide for Pokemon Red, and it used to say, I think it said to me, that the first switch, you got to find the first switch yourself, and then the second switch is directly right to it, like it's right next to it. And I think one of the trainers in here actually says it's right next to it, and I think that's kind of like a trick question, a, a, like a trick answer, it's kind of like, yeah, it literally is right next to it. I think. Um, so there's only trash in here, only trash in here, only trash in here. If you find these ones, then I have no idea where you're meant to go, but. Uh, nope. 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 Of course it'd be on the bottom right. That's the very last one. Alright, turn that on. And it is, yeah, that's that. I think that's how it works. You just hit the one that's right next to it. So, okay. Lieutenant Surge, how's it going? Um, I think we're ready for this. Let's, uh, I don't know what level his Pokemon are, and he's got six Pokemon. I forgot about that. I keep forgetting that they have six Pokemon, but... Alright. Let's do this, Lieutenant Surge. Do you think you've got what it takes to take down the almighty Game Boy Luke? He has a Fluffy! Oh my god. Oh, the, the, we're overleveled. We got this, man. Level 29. I'm just gonna dig right here. Alright, Flaffy, what have you got? What have you got? Thunderbolt? Thunder Wave. Okay, that wasn't going to do too much to us anyway. Hopefully this Dig will take it out. It has got Static. Uh, dig is not going to take it out. And we're not going to get paralyzed. We are going to get paralyzed. <laughs> God damn it. Okay. Uh, I could easily go for the Low Kick. Uh, but I might just... Actually, I'm tell you what. I will go for Low Kick. Because it's... We are... I'm actually glad he's done that. I'm glad that he's healed up now. Rather than later. And I probably should have just gone for Karate Chop. But... Uh, I should have... Oh no, please not again. Not again, I just used Rock Tomb as well and I didn't mean to. That might not do enough damage. Please break the sub. Thank you. 
We are not fucking around, Dreano. I don't I don't want any more of any more of this crazy substitute shenanigans going on. I can't be dealing with it. Alright. Alright, we've already taken a bit of damage right here. And he's gonna go into Jolteon. I do not trust what this Jolteon has. Uh, I'm gonna go into Blur because Blur can kind of is kind of our wall for this gym right now. Because he can he can take electric moves well. Um, however, this Jolteon can learn Charlie Ball. I'm not like seriously, I'm not um, doubting anything. This 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 team can have anything. After seeing Substitute, this this team could have anything. He's gonna set up an agility here. Alright, this is some serious top level shit right here. Uh, I feel like I'm on to be a master. <laughs> Alright, let's make sure Mad Bro, your Mad Bro is full HP. You know for Shockwave. Um, that's gonna do nothing. Alright, that's good. That's that's really good. We're just gonna go for how much physical attack? I need to compare physical and special attack on this guy again. Alright, so he has more special attacks, so we'd be better off using Ice Punch rather than Karate Chop. So let's go for the Ice Punch. He's gonna go for Pin Missile. Uh, that's pretty weak, actually. That was a critical hit, so the rest are gonna be critical hits, I do believe. Uh, no, they're not. Okay. Hit twice. It's not gonna do anything. Let's just go for the Ice Punch. Um, half health, maybe? Not even. Alright, let's try Karate Chop, because Jolteon's physical defense has got to be worse than that. Worse than his special defense. Alright, Karate Chop, show us what you got. And that's going to do a hell of a lot more because we got the crit, and then Karate Chop does actually have a larger chance of hitting uh, crits. And I don't know why Jolteon used Agility, actually, because it is one of the most fastest Pokemon uh, in its tier, so I don't know why. But whatever. Taking that guy down. 100, well, 1,054 experience, not bad. Uh, Chinchow! Alright, Chinchow, that's something different. Uh, I would have switched. I should have probably switched into Ludicolo. I just wanted to get this super potion off on Blurg first. Uh, he's gonna go for Thunder Wave. That's absolutely fine. You can do that all day, man. I really don't care. Um, what we're gonna do is switch into Macarena. Hey, Macarena! And we're gonna go for Bullet Seed because that will easily take this guy out. He's gonna go for Water Pulse, which is like quad resisted. That's not gonna do anything to us. Confusion Hacks. All right, no, we're good. We're gonna go for the Bullet Seed. Let's take this guy out. He obviously uh, chatted up Misty to get that. Water Pulse TM. But well, he's not going to do too much damage. But obviously, you know, if it hits more than twice, which it didn't. Which is a bit gay, but... You know how it goes. Um, let's try again. It is very luck-based. And he is going to go for Confuse Ray. The set on this freaking Chin Chow. Freaking Parafusion. That's disgusting. Alright. Come on, Macron. You've got a 0.25 chance of actually attacking. And he's going to pull through because this Ludicolo is well-trained. Look at him go. Hit the four. Hit the four bullet seeds. No, it's only a hit two. Alright, I take it back. You're terribly trained. Um, I'm just going to go for the Paralyze Hill because I really, really don't fancy my chances at actually... Yeah, it's going to paralyze me again. Alright, okay, no. Break through the confusion. Come on, man. Come on, man. Yes. Alright, we got the we got the Chincha. I can switch out this, um, this Ludicolo now. His job is done. I'm waiting for the Raichu. I'm waiting for the Raichu Electabuzz. Um, and he's gonna go into Manectric. Alright, let's go into, uh, let's go into Primate right here. Alright, let's see what you got. Manectric, level 26, okay. Uh, I'm going for Dig. We are faster than it, surprisingly. This Primate is actually doing work right now. I'm gonna Dig, and he's gonna go for the Thunder Wave. They're trying to pr paralyze me again. I'm just gonna take this guy down with a Dig. Go on. That's not going to be enough to take it down, but that's, uh, that's pretty hefty damage right there. I'm happy with that. I just hope I don't get the uh, power hacks uh, on the next turn. Let's go for the Karate Chop. He's going to go for Flamethrower. Th <laughs> Holy shit. That is going to do... That's not even that much damage, but Manetric just just, just used Flamethrower on me. Imagine if you had a Grass-type Pokemon to get through this. Or you had Smooch him. You didn't expect that. That's crazy. Uh, he's going to go into Magneton. Now, I'm pretty sure we can do a lot of damage to Magneton because we have Karate Chop. Uh, he's gonna go for Shockwave. Now I think about it, that probably might do a bit of damage. 17, we're good. Okay, I'm probably gonna switch out. Um, or you just use the Hype Potion, actually, that we picked up earlier. Uh, to get back to max HP. Let's do that real quick. He's gonna go for another Shockwave. Now let's calculate how much damage this move does. We're on 82 health. And it's gonna do about... That's at 36. And he has 36 HP. So, uh, really, I could attack here, and I could probably take out this Magneton. Let's just hope we don't get the Power Hacks, and uh, he, he doesn't get a crit, because that would make me cry. Crits are gay. 
And we're gonna survive, I'm gonna karate chop. Alright, cool. That's Magneton taken care of. Okay. Um, almost level 30, and then he's gonna leave, uh, he's gonna end, end this with Raichu, so here's the Raichu. Um, let's just check Ludicolo's stats real quick. What's your special defense? 20, 72. 72. I think we should go into, um, let's go into, uh, Ludicolo real quick. And, 27, okay. I'm gonna go for Fake Out straight off the bat, because I can get some easy damage off of the Fake Out. That's gonna, that's a crit, not bad. Not bad at all. I'm going for Bullet Seed. It's going to use Focus Punch. What? What? It's got focus. Is it a sub Focus Punch set? Wow, Bullet Seed does nothing. Holy crap. Let's get the five Bullet Seeds off Macarena. You know you, you know you want to. Alright, it's three. Okay, I can I can deal with that. Try, imagine if I tried to set up or something though. This is definitely a sub Focus Punch set. And if it is, I'm dead. Because I don't think I can do enough damage to... Um... Do enough damage to break the sub. I mean, so much as Swift does. Oh, uh, that does that does quite a bit of damage. And he's just going to persistently go for the Focus Punch. And I mean, we could probably finish him off just by going for the Nature Powers here. So I'm just going to speed this up. Go yeah, Focus Punch again. Swift. Focus Punch. Moo Moo Milk. What the hell? What the hell? He has Moo Moo Milk. Nature Power. Swift. And he's down. Game over. I don't know why he was just going for Focus Punch, he, he must have thought, oh, that's a powerful move, I'm just going to go for that. When he's going to slip up, but no, we have defeated him without losing a team member. Can I just remind you guys, we haven't lost a team member yet, which is insane. We're going to hit the um, TM34 for Shockwave real real quick, and um, honestly, I don't really know who can learn this. I don't really think we have an electric Pokemon to teach it to, because Blurg's got Thunder Punch, and we may as well teach it to Echo, to be honest with you. Um, I'm gonna get rid of Attract because I haven't used it yet, and I don't feel like he's gonna have the chance to use it. So I think more type coverage, the better. Um, his special attack is good, uh, so I mean that's more type coverage for Echo because he can take out more Pokemon. Just in case Electabuzz dies, then we do need to take out Flying or Water type Pokemon. Um, he'll always come in handy. So that's kind of good. I'm really happy with that, guys. We're doing really well. We haven't lost a single team member yet. I don't think we have anyway. No, wait, we did lose. Oh wait, we lost Shelter. We lost Shelter on the very first gym. I do. I do apologize, I am mistaken, but we are doing pretty well. Hello. Hey. Oh, hello, Zav, how are you doing? It's me, one of Professor Oak's aides. Did you meet the other aide? He had a package from Professor Oak for you, Zav. He said he'd look for you around Route 2, Zav. If you're around Route 2 area, please go look for him. Okay, so I think that's the HM for Flash, which we may as well get, because getting through Rock Tunnel can be kind of a pain. I do know my way through there, back, back of my hand, but for recording purposes, I think I should get Flash. I can get through without it, because um, I've done it so many times, and I know that place like the back of my hand. Oh! Voice break uh, at the back of my hand. So what we're gonna do is uh, just, Pigeon needs freaking experience right now. He needs he needs some uh, he needs some loving. What we're gonna do is um, go through the Diglett cave. I think I think you can only still catch Diglett in here, um, but we will find an encounter. I'm not gonna. I don't think I'll catch it because I don't want to risk losing or taking damage. I just want to go get this. Um, HM for Flash and get out of here, so... Wow, done sparse. No. Let's use the Super Potion. Oh, uh, the Super Potion? Super Potion. I'm not going to use done sparse. If anyone's mad at me for skipping the done sparse, I'm just like... Wow. Do you know who done sparse is? Do you, do you even know? Alright, let's um get through here. Come on, this Diglett's Cave is ridiculously long. Like, ridiculously long. Have they extended this? Why would you make it longer? Why would you do that? Alright, we're out. Hey, dude. I went inside Rock Tunnel, but it's pitch black and scary in there. If I can get to Pokemon, use Flash and hint, hint, nudge, nudge. So yeah, once we get here, you'll know that we are back in Route 2. Is there anything up here? No. Apparently not. Um, There's nothing here. Is there a hidden item here? No. Okay. And there is a house. What do we have here? If any Pokemon just have no energy, blah blah blah. Okay. But you, do you want to trade? I'm looking for a Pokemon Magnemite. Would you want to trade one for my Mr. Mime? Mr. Mime. No, thank you, sir. If we cut this tree, come down here. I'm pretty sure you can actually. I think I looked up where you could get the starters, and I think someone gives you a Pokemon. Hey, bro. Hey, remember, I'm one of Professor Oak's aides. If your Pokedex is a complete stator of 10 species, I'm supposed to give you a reward. Give me the HMO5 now. Wow. 
Wow. We need one more Kanto Pokemon. We need to catch one more Kanto Pokemon. God damn it, man. We need to catch one more Kanto Pokemon. Obviously, I picked up Squirtle and all those Pokemon, and that counts as encounters for Kanto. So if I just cut this tree down and just find a Pokemon that we... That's from Kanto. And then just catch it and then release it afterwards just to get the HMO5. Uh, Shroomus is not from Kanto. Pidgey is come from Kanto, but I kind of already have you. Hootoot's not from Kanto. Should we go and Viridian Forest? Forest, because there are probably Weedle and stuff in here. Metapod, you're from Kanto. Get him up, Pokeball! What the hell? What the hell? The fuck, man? Fucking Metapod. Alright, Caterpie will do. The struggle is real. The struggle is real. How can I not catch a fucking Caterpie in a fucking Grey Ball? Are you joking right now? That's gonna kill it. Wow. Wow, man. I just used... I just used... I, I have nothing... Seriously, that's what, what should have happened the first time around. God damn it. I tried to use Syndical as well. I mean, yeah, whatever. Whatever. It's whatever. I forgot for a second there. Alright, let's, let's get this freaking HMO5. Yes, blah, 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 blah. Thank you. All right, HMO5. I'm pretty sure uh, Syndical can learn that. If not, I'll be upset. He can! God damn it, man. All right, let's, um... Let's get back to Vermillion. Real quick. And then we'll check out who can learn both those moves. Um, Super Repel. Let's just cut through here. I do not want to walk all the way through this freaking cave. It's ridiculous. Dog Trio, scared of you. See you later. Dunsparce, not really that scared of you. Dunsparce, a fairy type. Lol, lol, lol. Right. Okay. Let's have a look in here. Heal out my mons. And let's see if anyone in the box can actually learn cut. And flash because I know I know I'm gonna need both. Um, Trico, you can learn flash, right? Can't you? Pretty sure a lot of grass types can learn flash. Nope. You can learn flash. Can you learn cut? You can learn cut. Where's the name rater in this game? It's in the freaking lavender. I was gonna call you slave. All right, we have Trico instead. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Um, I think it's about time. We could grind in the little grass bit to the right of this place. I'm going to check that out real quick because there might be a hidden item or something. So let's just go this way. Maybe some items or stuff. Awakening. Um, We have an encounter on this place, actually. Let's, um, let's see what we can find. Natu! 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 Natu, I I have not used a Natu in forever. Like I like Natu. Natu is cool as shit. We're gonna catch this Natu. Um, I don't know what to call it though. It looks like a freaking Egyptian bird. I'm gonna call it Slifer. <laughs> oh, the Wing Dragon of Ra. I'm gonna call it Slifer because I can. I'm gonna call you Slifer. I don't know how to spell Slifer. Is it just. It's not PH, is it? I'm gonna call you Slifer. Ain't nobody care. No, Natu's not dead. Don't send her to the dead box. That's not bad. I'm actually gonna replace Pidgeotto with Natu because I've used Pidgeotto a lot in previous plays. Um, and yeah, I just kind of wanna use Natu, if I'm honest with you. Psychic Pokemon would be nice to have on the team. It adds more type coverage for a start. So we're going to do that. I'm going to get you. I'm going to replace him with you. And I'm going to put you in the box. Sorry, Pidgeotto, but Natu is OP. Natu is OP. Lacks nature, neutral, I think. Not bad. Not even bad. I'm happy with that capture, you know. I didn't expect to freaking find a Natu, that's for sure. Um, But no, I'm going to end it off here. In between episodes, I'll probably level up to Slifer, so it's like... Level 29, it may evolve, um, but I'll be sure to update the sidebars and stuff like that. So, thanks for watching, guys, and I guess I'll catch you in the next episode of Fire Rider Mega Nuzlocke. If you have enjoyed this episode, then don't forget to leave a comment and a rating, and I will see you in the next episode. See you later, guys.